Hey guys, today I'm gonna be co commentating and uh, eating with uh, Legion Thastos, or the group Sepulcher, I think. Yes. Or we can pick a third name, which is Heresy Art Grim, to yep. make this even more convoluted. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, yeah, I forgot about the key. You don't need a key, just kick the door down. Well, too bad. I'm very formal, and I like keys. But you're also a British man. Clearly, you'd be trying to kick down the door. Fun fact, I think the foreman would be toothless because of the minerals and gases that would be in the mine. So that could actually be an actual thing rather than just, oh hey, he has no teeth. It's so dark in here. Generally what happens in a horror game. Yeah, and my lantern is out of oil as well. And there's nothing that just lit anymore. I wish set fire to the floor, it's made of wood. You don't yeah, need the floor. Set fire to the wine, <laughs> and then while I wouldn't advocate setting fire to the wine, if you need to, it's a good idea. Actually, I read that the wine explodes them. So, yeah. explosive wine? <laughs> what? <laughs> yes, explosive wine. And why is it warning me that an enemy is near? Do you see the hint up above? Oh, I see it. Yeah. I'm losing my sanity so much. That's probably because you're in the dark. I know. Need to start burning that wine. It, even though it's the same as burning money, you need to do it. Which way should I go? Um, through the door that's open, the one that you're looking at now, because uh, that goes nowhere. Jump up! And you're not scared, of course. That scared me because it's banging on a wall. You tell her to shut up. Or hit it with a wine barrel. Maybe you'll intoxicate it and it'll get drunk and pass it out. I was half expecting that door not to open actually. Really? Yeah, because I thought the barrel would have got in the way. And that is going to lead to your demise. No, it's not. <gasps> I can light this. Stand here a moment. Suddenly monsters appear. Suddenly, a wild amnesia monster appears. Go, torchlight. Oh wait, that'll make it worse. Oh my gosh, I can still open these drawers. What's happening? Oh, it feels like... Explosive wine. My chest is going... Oh, yes. My God! Wilhelm, do something! See all the stuff on the floor? Except we're not... What, the stuff that looks like flesh or the stuff that looks like mushrooms? Because to me it looks like both. <gasps> Profanity! You should have put a spoiler and a language warning on this video. I didn't even know that it would do that. I didn't know it would do that. I've never played this game before. <laughs> I know. I've never even watched a playthrough of it or anything. <gasps> oh, it's just something that I need to continue, but still. Good. Aqua Regia. I presume that's pronounced Regia. Hey, do you want to read this? You have a good storytelling voice. <sighs> My name is Wilhelm, House of Gensch. These are my final words. I'm, I'm assuming this is what it says. Because I can't read it very well at the moment I have asleep. My confession and testament. Two years ago I was summoned to the castle... What's that? Breidenberg? Breidenberg. Great. That's German. As most of the aristocracy, I was curious about what was supposed to happen to the Knight of Order. 
good one for me, and I really can't read half of this well, and accepted the invitation. The Baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. It dawned on me the time of the contract was sorted, and that the reason I was chosen was because of my follies of my past, and not the honors I've been rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim, and to do so without asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position within the noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but I swiftly, and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, I've brought men, women, and children to the next arrow, please. <laughs> Brennenberg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen nor heard from again. Tonight, the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us in a toast. The wine tasted fine and my men drank without restraint. And so begins the punishment for our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into his diabolic ways. My men are screaming, their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones, and I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer continue writing this really weird story. Yep. Yeah, that's it. So that should pretty much settle the old, uh, what is this mess on the floor thing. Yep. It seems the people have actually liquefied. All because they drank wine. Yep. Lightweights. Let's go into that door over there. Suddenly, monster. If, oh gosh, do you see those bugs crawling on the screen? That's gross. They're like crawling on his eyeball. Reminds me of the scene from The Mummy, with all the scarabs. I haven't actually seen The Mummy. Well, I've seen The Mummy 3, but none of the others. It's weird. You've watched the worst one. <laughs> well, that's nice to know. You watched the one that took place in Asia, and then the second oh. one. Yes. I have Hey. Enter. How fast are you going to regret lighting your lantern? I don't know. And I'm guessing... Oh, that's you're great. I got a move. <laughs> I get knocked out by a barrel. <clears throat> See? Wine. It's, it's dangerous, you know. Mm -hmm. You never know when wine is going to become sentient and decide to knock you out from above. Probably white wine. Red wine wouldn't be that nasty to you. So, now I gotta move stuff from the door. That's just great. You could. Or you can probably throw explosive wine at it. it Wait, this guy can... This, this guy can shift boulders with one hand. Yep. And entire planks of that's at least, what, 10 kilos? One hand? What is this guy, Arnold Schwarzenegger? He's on a whole bunch of steroids. He's on something. Yep. I'm somewhat convinced at this point that those are actually styrofoam boulders they were stockpiling for a movie shoot. As opposed to actual boulders. No, you're probably not meant it's to. Stuck. Right click. Give it an extra push. Oh yeah, I forgot about the right click. I only know about it because I read the hint. <gasps> if you. Oh, it's leading. It's got the bottom now. Go.
and then you just pull it out from the way it's leaning. There you go, and then just pull. It leaned over to the other Come side. Come on! Well, you can probably wedge the door open at that angle now. Oh yeah, I forgot. Or you can just keep messing around Was that with it. There before? I don't remember. The blood? Probably oh, not, because hey, you just have a flashback. Now. 